All right, this is another really cool feature that we have inside the Squeeze Page software package. Most of you have seen this where you go to a website and you go, uh, you watch their video, or maybe you decide that uh, you want to go there to buy something, but you change your mind. And you try to leave or you hit the back button, and a little box pops up and says, Hey, wait, before you go, I got something special to give you. Uh, if you didn't like this offer, basically, I've got something else. We've actually encoded that into your Squeeze Page package, so you have the ability to turn that kind of a feature on or off. It will definitely increase your conversions because you, now you can send people to something else, maybe another opt-in, maybe that's similar, or you can send them straight to, like, say, a ClickBank um, affiliate link. So if you're selling somebody, or I should say, trying to entice them to get your special report on how to build six-pack abs, and they decide they don't want that special report, or they don't feel comfortable opting into your page, you can say, hey, wait, before you leave, um, there's a really great program out there that I'd like to introduce you to that uh, really worked well for me. And, of course, don't lie. If it did work well for you, then, then use it. And you can send them straight to that other page through your affiliate link, and hopefully they'll buy it. If they buy it, then you get your affiliate commission. Or you can send them right to another opt-in of your own that might be similar. Maybe you don't want six-pack abs, but I'll show you how, how to have crazy, massive, I don't know, bodybuilder arms something you know if you're going to be in that that niche or it could be anything you know any niche you want to get into so we have a turn on exit redirect you can turn this on or off right here there's the radio buttons right now we have it set to off so if I'm going to turn it on you can then choose the URL that you want to redirect to so basically after they sl select the uh, ability to say yes I will stay on this page what re redirect URL do you want them to go to? You want them to go to another squeeze page of your own, another page on this domain name. Maybe you want to send them to your affiliate uh, link for ClickBank. You, whatever you want to send them to, you just click that, uh, put that link right in this uh, box. Okay, and that automatically goes into the code. The next thing you do before you hit the Save Settings button is choose the pop-up pop message that comes up. Right now it says, don't miss this. Click Stay on this page for a special offer. You can change that to, um, hey, wait, before you go, which will just instead don't miss this before you go. Okay, and maybe we'll do an extra. Um, maybe we'll do two of those. Okay, so we do extra um, exclamation marks. Wait before before you go. Click stay on this page for a special offer. Let's put the word wait in there too. I like that. Okay, hit the save settings button, and that will actually change. Okay, and let's go take a look. So right now this is our squeeze page. It's a video squeeze page. We go ahead and click on the uh, refresh button and nothing happens, of course, right away because we're just refreshing that so the code's on the page. If we refresh it again, watch what happens. It pops right up. Hey, wait, before you go, and you get the ability to stay on this page or leave this page. Okay, this text here, of course, I probably should spell that properly, it will be what pops up inside of this, uh, this area. So they can choose. I'm going to choose to go ahead and stay on this page. Actually, um, I'm going to leave this page for me because I want to go back to this refreshed page. I don't want to end up on the other page URL just yet. I want to go back and make some changes to that exit redirect code since I misspelled that one word. Okay. And another little tip to this is you can't put this in quotations. So you don't want to put in quotations, click stay on this page. If you do that, it actually will break the code and it won't work. I mean, your site will still work, but the exit redirect won't. So whatever you do, you can use apostrophes if you want to, which is just the, um, like this apostrophe S. People use that sometimes. And uh, But just don't use quotation marks around any portion of this because that will mess up the code the way that the uh, code works. Okay, so we're going to hit the Save Settings button again. This will just quickly change. I have to um, refresh one more time. Okay, now you see that the actual change took place. Wait, I got it spelled properly. So very simply, that's how it works. Now, if we wanted to say, okay, I'll take a, this person on the offer, you click stay on this page, and instead of staying on the page, it takes you to wherever you want them to go. So then I'm going to click the back button and get out of that page and go back to my main squeeze page. All right, so in a nutshell, that is our uh, tutorial for the exit redirect settings, which again is another very powerful tool inside the Squeeze Pages software. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Go ahead and get your own um, exit redirect settings set up now if you will choose to use those or turn those off. I'm going to turn it off for myself because while I'm editing my Squeeze Page and checking changes, the exit redirect stuff gets a little bit annoying every now and then. It pops up. So definitely I would wait to turn this on until the very end once you've edited all your Squeeze Pages. Uh, you can also use our split testing features to split test whether or not you get more opt-ins or you make, um, you make more revenue by using exit redirects on some of your pages, of your, you know, people that visit your split test pages um, using Google Optimizer as well. So you can edit this and you can turn this on in some of your split test pages or not. 
if you want to use split testing. If not, you want to keep it super simple, you can edit it by turning it on or off in your main squeeze page. Okay, I'll catch you all in the next video.